Okay, let's now assemble the antenna. Uh, I got the pipe cut to 5 feet length. Uh, this cap came with the antenna. So, although it's not perfect, you can see the cut here. Let me see if I can move that. It's not very perfect here, but I think it will be okay to just, uh, you know, put this cap on top. So, no glue, nothing. Just some pressure here. Oops. Yep, it fits well. Let's see. Yeah, it doesn't look like well, it will move. Okay, so that's the one side. I'm going to try to reverse this now without touching the camera here. It's a five feet long cable. And I'm going to pick up from the ground, from the floor here, uh, the antenna itself. So give me a quick second. Okay, I got the antenna. So all I will do is feed that through the pipe. So hopefully. I can capture that uh, in a way this works okay. So let me get this. Uh, oops, okay, first string there. Wire is in, the coax is in. Now the 300 ohm portion is, is in. Oops, uh, note the tuning done here. It's kind of going down, going down, going down. And now goes all the way down and this is the top cap now which should be just again plugged in and, and pressed guess what have a nice antenna Ed Fong's uh, built and tuned by his students I bought in eBay and I'm really dying to get this up and running I just don't have a uh, a coax that will fit my N female connector yet, but it's on order. So as soon as it gets in, I will put my two meters and uh, 70 centimeters to run here to this antenna. And uh, you know that's pretty much it. Thank you. Appreciate your your look. Uh, you know, watching this movie. And as you can see, it says here ham 250 watts. That's the 250 watts version with N connector. So all the options are there. Thanks again. Bye.